Hey, welcome to the Backstage Pass. We're here today for the Elite Women's Road Race. Uh, obviously, I have pretty fond memories from this race last year after taking the national title, and we're here with a strong team and looking to have a really solid and tough race. The other important thing is that we always get to race before the Green Edge men, so we're looking to get one up on them before they can. Yeah, it's been really fun so far with the Bay Crits and then a couple of the, the national races, the TT and the Crits, so I'm pretty excited. This is the main event, so it's going to be a hard day for everybody, but I reckon we're going to come away happy. And how do you reckon the race is going to pan out? Who are the big dangers today, you reckon? There's definitely a few dark horses. I'm sitting next to one of them right now, Grace Salzberger. <laughs> but um, I think we've got the numbers, we've got the brains and the, the fitness, so hopefully we can pull it off. Well actually I think today we're going to see a fantastic women's race. I'm really looking forward to this, more than the men actually. Uh, Orica Green Edge, yes they want to win, the pressure's on them because while, well they should win really because they're taking the jersey to Europe. And if I was a betting man, I'd go Tiff Cromwell and Shara Gillow. I think they're both on terrific form. Uh, but what the heck, we're going to see a great race. But don't anybody ever tell me this is easier of course than last year. Well here we are on the start line, only 10 minutes ago I think. You can see our directors are very serious. Also like their cokes and getting as many treats as they can, the healthy, conscious, nutritious, conscious people they are while we're warming up. The Good Luck Donuts, it's a new tradition that uh, stems from the, the very high hand uh, VIP treatment that you received yourself then when you came to training camp in uh, Canberra and we had Foods of the World. So that's the follow up, is the new tradition for the season, the Good Luck Donut before we start. When we turn right, just when I was going from the lead to the main bunch, it is 1 minute 50, 1 minute 50, that's a 25.7 kilometer mark. They charge $2 for a sausage, you know what I'd do? I'd go free parking like they went, but I'd go, you get a free sausage for 4 bucks. <laughs> free sausage for 4 bucks? Yeah. Alright, okay. <laughs> Eh? But you get free parking. Oh. Yeah, good. So just before the downhill, we spoke with Jessie. The brake was getting a little bit disorganized. Uh, she's saying her legs are feeling good, her chest is feeling a little bit tight uh, when she goes up the hill. So I told her to continue contributing. She was thinking about sitting on. I told her to continue contributing to the brake, uh, just as long as she can guarantee that she's going to keep herself in there. Uh, at 3.30, obviously, this is a good position for us, so just to keep that going for the next little while. Sorry? What did they call? Uh, I think Elvin. Elvin's off the front. Uh, Elvin's off the front. Two riders coming through, they're going to be joining the chase three. Alright, that's good. Two riders joining the chase three, there's five riders now. Chief. <laughs> they're all looking fine. Come on, Gracie. Come on, Gracie. Come on, Gracie. Gracie Elvin, the parallel. Yes! Yeah! Oh, that was it! Yeah! Right at 205. Yeah! Yeah! Thank you for the race, everyone. Thank you. <laughs> 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 I think they expected that, the rest of the girls, so it was perfect. She's our dark horse. Oh, Dan, that was, uh, that was stressful. That was a stressful race, man. I, uh, I can't say I was comfortable for one minute of that race. Um, it was probably... I was more comfortable at the start. The second half of the race was stressful. Um, we, uh, you know, the most important thing, we won the race, but uh, we uh, weren't as dominant as what we have been in the past, so uh, it was a relief as soon as Gracie crossed the line. Awesome job from, from Gracie, first year in the team, being so young and everything. Took the weight of the whole team on her shoulders the last couple of laps today, so impressive. Good job.
Congratulations, that was sensational. Sensational. Thank you. Good on you, mate. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. How are you feeling? Yeah. Like a bag of shit. <laughs> Thank you. Good on you, Jess. Well done. Well done. Great job. Uh, I don't know, but I'm wet, man. I'm covered in sweat. So, uh, yeah, fantastic result. We didn't pan out at all the way that we expected. Um, I had a thought that Gracie could win this, but it was going to be a long range attack. Uh, she did that the hard way after doing a lot of work for the team as well, too. She was it today. So, um, yeah, it was touch and go all the way to the finish. Pretty exciting race, actually, as you can tell. But, uh, yeah, she pulled it off. What can I say? Fantastic. I'm a little bit excited. <laughs> Hey guys, hope you enjoyed Backstage Pass for today. We put on a good show. I'm beyond happy with, to get the jersey, but it was anyone's race today. All the Green Edge girls rode really well. So to take it home for the team, couldn't be happier. Thanks.